Welcome to the Arts in Westchester. My special guest today is Anna Vidovich, an extremely fine guitarist. If I had to say, frankly, I think one of the best in the world. So uh, welcome, Anna. Thank you so much. And I guess I saw your name somewhere and found you on YouTube and saw you playing at, mm -hmm. uh, I think, 92nd Street Y. Yes. And then, uh, I, uh, having heard you, I found your CD and then I called you and you responded affirmatively. Yes, yeah, I so was very excited to hear from you, yeah. especially when you said you were uh, doing a film about Taroba and right. one of my favorite composers. Apparently you did an entire CD on Taroba. Yes. And, uh, but you didn't do his complete works. No, no, no I did not. So maybe you would at some point do another uh, set. What I'd attracted like to. you to uh, Taroba, as if I didn't know, but... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, I've uh, been a fan of Taroba for quite a long time. Uh, uh, let's say his full name, okay? Sure. Uh, Federico Moreno Taroba. Good. Um, my brothers are, my, one of my brothers is a guitarist, so um, that's how I started playing guitar. And I remember Victor, Victor is his name, he used to play Taroba a lot. And I just remember being uh, really amazed by the beauty of the music yeah. and, and the sound and all the, the colors. Of course, Victor is a wonderful guitarist, so he, he sounded wonderful. So I was always really amazed by the music of Taroba. And when I got a little bit older, I, I started playing Taroba. Mm -hmm. and played until now. I still play a lot of Taroba mm -hmm. music. Taroba was not a guitarist himself, no. I believe. No. So what do you know about him personally? Well, I uh, know of him from the music that I, that okay. I play. And, and uh, it's interesting because what you said about the colors and, and, and the, the, the beauty of the sound, I think with Taroba's music, what, what I'm really interested in and, um, and it's, what is very challenging is that you, c you can create a lot of different colors, a lot mm -hmm. of different moods, and, and I think his, his music is so alive. Yeah. And that, that really, um, I really like that very much, and I like to kind of tell a story through the music, and, and his music really right. is wonderful, and you can just say so many things. So why don't we um, listen to something we've recently taped here in our studio.
played uh, with all of the things we were talking about, the textures, the pianissimos, the... It's romantic music, I mean, there's no doubt about it, and yet it has, a, a, to me, a certain classic restraint. It doesn't, it doesn't go gobby on you. Yes. I mean, do you agree with that? I think so, I think so. Um, you know, with guitar, it's very interesting because, speaking of colors again, guitar has so many different colors. And you can really explore it, and especially, I feel, in Tarobus music. I really try to have these extremes, you know, pianos and fortes, and also mm -hmm. in between crescendos, decrescendos. Right. So just really sort of explore this huge palette that guitar mm -hmm. guitar offers. And, and But yes, Tarobus music, I, I think it's, um, like I said, it's very alive. Yes. And um, I think you can sort of let yourself have some freedom, but also, you know, stay within mm -hmm. within the boundaries. You've traveled a lot. You do perform as a soloist. So share with me and our audience some of the impressions of, I know you don't go sightseeing, obviously. You've been, we've been talking about that. Yes. But you, you've been with audiences. Uh, share with us where you've performed. 
Well, I've been performing um, since I was 10 years old or so. I, st I started playing when I was five. Right. So I started and you're originally from Croatia. Yes. Right, correct? Yes. yes. You were born there. I was born in Croatia yeah. and lived there um, for 20 years. And then I, I, I came to the States to mm -hmm. study, to do my master's. Okay. And I decided to stay here. So, uh, But I've been traveling a lot um, since I came to the States. I've been touring throughout the States, and, and but also to Asia and to um, um, South America as well. I've, I had a very nice tour last year in South America. What what countries? Uh, Brazil, in Brazil, when I went to Colombia. Now, do they have, a, do you think, a special affinity for the guitar that you might not find in, let's say, Soviet Union or in, <laughs> in Finland or they actually do they they very much appreciate guitar um, and are you know they're very warm people very welcoming mm -hmm. that that was the first time I went there so I didn't really know I knew of, that they were very warm and mm -hmm. welcoming but I didn't know exactly what to expect I was very surprised and very pleased with with their warmth and they very much appreciated the music you also played here um, Something from the Castle Suite, Castellan, which, which has also three movements, and the first one was Fandanguillo, Arada, and Danza. <laughs>
You're headed back to Croatia uh, in a day or so. Yes. And will that be uh, just a holiday time to be with family, or, or what will that be? Uh, you do have a, any performances there? Yes, I, I'll play a little bit with my brother okay. and a solo, and but mainly this is for just uh, visiting my family because okay. I don't I don't see them much. Right. I want to thank you so much for coming up again, and it was a real treat. I knew you would play very well because I listened to your CD. Incidentally, why don't we mention your website? Mm -hmm. Can you share with us? Sure. My website is uh, anavidovich.com. Okay. So. And what are, what are your performances going to be like going forward here in the States? Are you going to be performing here? Yes, I'll, um, after I come back from Croatia, I will be performing uh, in, in the States and I go to Florida, I go to, I'll play one concert in Baltimore and then uh, Portland, Oregon, mm. and then I go to Asia, actually, I'm very excited going back in Asia. Oh, in, where, in, Asia is a big place, where are you going? Uh, Korea. Korea? I go Korea, yes. Oh, I yeah. bet they're very big enthusiasts. They're, yes, they're wonderful, also wonderful audience, very different, you know, yeah. culturally, but a very nice audience and I mm -hmm. enjoy my time very much there. Well, it, uh, I appreciate very much your coming up. It's really been fabulous. Thank and you. our viewers, I hope you had a very special time today as well. Um, that's all for now for the Arts in Westchester, and I'll see you again shortly. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.